Well, Esri, first of all, welcome to Aston Villa. Just talk us through your emotions right now. Uh, yeah, I'm over the moon, you know, to train such a massive club like Aston Villa. Just can't wait to get started and meet the lads. Of course, it's a reunion for you with Dean Smith and Richard O'Kelly. Yeah, yeah, I mean, um, we got on very well at, at Brentford and, you know, I can't wait to get started with, with Dean and Richard again and especially John Terry. Is that part of the reason why you came here, that reunion with Dean? Yeah, of course. I mean, um, we had a good relationship, me and Dean and Richard. And also you've got um, a legend in John Terry here as well. He's also a centre-back, or he used to be a centre-back. So for him here as well, I think it will help me a lot. You're a central defender, so yeah. tell us what kind of player you are. Uh, I'd say I'm very comfortable on the ball. I like to play out from the back. Um, I can defend, I can go forward. First day here at Bodymore Heath, what do you make of your new surroundings? Yeah, it's great. You know, the facilities are a joke. So, I mean, uh, for me to be here, it's, it's a good feeling for me and my family. Of course, you played at Villa Park for Brentford last season. What did you make of that? Yeah, the atmosphere was immense. And um, for me to be here now to play in front of the fans, you know, week in, week out, I think for me it's something special. You're looking forward to stepping out of Villa Park for the first time as a, as a Villa player? Yes, of course. Can't wait. So it's been quite a journey for you personally, going from Charlton in League One to the Championship with Brentford and now you're a Premier League player? Yeah, I mean, I think I'm speechless right now. It's a dream come true. I think as a little kid, I always used to you know, dream about playing in the Premier League and for it to actually happen now. Um, yeah, it's a dream come true for me and my family. How much are you relishing that challenge of playing against some of the top players in the world in the Premier League? Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. You know, it's a challenge that I look forward to very much. So for me to you know, finally be able to do it against the top players in the world, yeah, it's a privilege. Of course, you've just been away with England's under-21s in, in Italy with a certain Tammy Abraham who was on loan here last season. Have you spoken to him about your move here and did he have good things to say about the club? Uh, yeah, I think I spoke to him before about it, but not about me moving here, but about how we find it here. He said nothing but good words about everyone here, you know, so I was looking forward to it as well. You're um, ready and raring to go now for pre-season. Obviously, you had that time in Italy with England's under-21s, but you had a chance to get away and rest and recuperate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been away for a bit, so I'm back now and raring to go. It's not long to go now until that first game of the season. You're a London boy. Yeah. You've played for London clubs all your career, so how fitting is it that Villa's first game back in the Premier League is going to be in London at Tottenham? Yeah, it's going to be good. You know, I've got a lot of family in London who would, who would love to come to that game. So for me, it's just about you know, um, taking a moment and doing everything I can to get in that starting eleven. Before then, it's a trip to America coming up very shortly. How much are you looking forward to that? Yeah, I'm looking forward to meeting the lads tomorrow you know, and getting out in America and starting training. How important is that time away in the United States going to be? Yeah, I think it's very important for everyone you know, to get fit and to get their minds right for the first game of the season. Esri, best of luck. Thank you very much.